However, I can't bring myself to move. It feels like both my feet have been nailed to the floor. It's almost as if my body and mind have become disconnected and fear has taken over my basic instincts. I know that I've gotten away as quickly as possible. The longer I stay here, the faster the death will come to claim me. What? This arena is infused with poison. I think you tried to assault me from the shadows. Such arrogance will be appalling lack of refinement. Well, good thing I got that, Mystico, because I didn't. Re I thought this was later on. The sound of Saber voicing her disgust brings back to reality and frees up my previous paralyzed thoughts. I'm okay now. I can move my feet and hands. There's no time for discussion. This must be an aspect of what the Servant's Noble Phantasm, or Servant's Noble Phantasm. I can feel the aura of death, even here. With this kind of Noble Phantasm, the source of it must be nearby. If we destroy it, the poison will dissipate. There's only one course of action to be taken. I will destroy this foul trickery with my blade. Man! Oh, we got a clan thingy. Is that what this is? Oh, it's a paradox. Um. Take it, take it, take it, take it. I saw a thing break and I was like, I'm just gonna attack. Oh, 70 experience for that? Well, that's where we need to go. Pray to her. I feel magic flowing from that tree. It must be the source. Destroy it and we will obliterate the poison. Let's go. Attack, huh? Um... Just in case, uh, guard. The last two. So it seems like that one's a more offensive tough thing. Pardon the uh, map being displayed constantly right about now. I hear the sound of two voices engaged in conversation at the end of the hall and slowly make my way over. Those voices can only belong to two people that I know of. It has to be Dan and his servant. How convenient. I will draw my blade here. I kind of want her to do what she wants, but we... We'll let you do what you want. The enemy doesn't seem to be aware of us, and I have Saber by my side. Only a fool would pass up this opportunity. I catch Saber's attention with a meaningful glance and start forward. Just before my consciousness fades into oblivion, my gaze is drawn to the servant clad in green. Suddenly, a sharp pain runs through me as I feel like a burning rod pierces my back and my vision fades. I don't think that's what we, uh, we're supposed to do. How did this idiot ever become a master? Do they really think I didn't notice them? As my consciousness fades, I only hear the mocking voice of the enemy servant, but I think I hear Saber berating me in a horace's voice. Dead end. Game over. Alright, let's do this legitly now. Oops. Oh yeah, that's right. We're back on the third floor. I think that's like... Well, technically, I guess it's the second because you can get one for uh, going ahead and uh, dying against Shinji. I don't think you can get a dead end before then. Yeah, we already know. Speed through! Yeah! Wrong. Oh. Take it, 
We'll fill in the map after I break that tree. Yeah, we're down here. Oops. Navigating the globe here. Hey, the sound of two voices. Yeah, we already know. Our strain the belligerent saber who is trying to be quiet or who's trying while trying to quiet my breathing. Attacking now would be a bad idea since I can learn a lot just by listening. What is the meaning of this? What's with that? I put up this little barrier so that you'd win, boss. I will wait until the elimination mode to take him out when I can drop out now. It'd be an easy victory for us. Who gave you the command to do such a deed? Even scavengers such as vultures that feed upon the carrion have at least a single shred of dignity. It's obvious by the heat of their voices that they do disagree about what strategy they should follow. The use of the yew tree is unnecessary for this spot. I thought I would forbid you to use it. It seems to me that you lack the most important trait. Pride. Pride, you say? But I just don't see myself seeking something so useless as that. I mean, I'm all for it and that's all we need to win this whole thing. If, really, it'd be the best thing in the world if we... If our enemies would just kill themselves and face our pride. Sorry, I'm not nearly the man you are. I'm just a pragmatic that'll resort to poison if it'll guarantee a kill. I see. Violating the trust. Ambush ambushes betrayal. These are things you rely on in battle. The servant put up a barrier on his own. It's obvious that there was some disagreement about their actions. Yeah, these two don't get along. It appears the two do not get along. <laughs> well spoken, Nero. Well spoken. I can emphasize with what that old knight is trying to say. There is no sense of beauty in his sermon sections. Also, there is far better poisons he could have used. Dan lowering his voice, although it's hard to determine whether he's doing it from scorn or disdain. I will not. I will now, or not order you to lower this barrier now. However, should you disobey me again, after a somewhat putely reply, gotcha, the sense of the presence disappeared, and I sigh in relief. So there is discord between the enemy and the servant. Well, the differences in ability between us is great. This might be my key to victory in the second round. As soon as we kill this tree, because I'm tired of the screen looking like this. Hornets! The hornets are back! Let me know in the comments if anyone's been stung by a hornet. Because it's not fun. Insanity? You attack a lot. Um... Uh... I, so, I'm gonna go attack guard, attack guard, attack guard. Okay, so you do like kind of all the things. So now we're getting into the complex patterns. 140 experience? This must be it. The source of the barrier, the new tree. Magic flows from where the tree towers over the arena. There's so much of it that those who are unprepared would drown in poison. It's filthy to even look upon such a vile thing. Yay! Tree's gone. Saber swallows in disgust, and in one swing, her blade swats down the source of the barrier. The destroyed tree vanishes as if nothing had ever been there. The moment the source of the barrier disappears, so does the pressure and pain crushing my body. But this barrier, we need to watch out for this servant. I'll leave the area to focus. First, we need more information. And we need to complete the map, because I skipped over a lot of things. Like this item. Obtain remedy. Now we get the joy of walking through walls again. Um, let's go back and finish this uh, other little area. Making sure that we can't get that way. Nothing over there either. Okay. We'll deal with that path in a minute. I gotta finish this little loop. Also, did I change... Oh, 
was wondering, like, why is it not inverted? So much better. Wow. Oh, there's a whole lot more. Okay. I'm going to defeat this thing while it's here, and then we'll head back. Back to dungeon crawling extreme and rock paper scissor fights. Ooh, paradox. Okay, so. Now that I've swapped the controls from being inverted to, you know, regular, it's gonna throw me off because I'm so used to inverted on this game. Um, take it, take it, take it, take it. No, no. We'll definitely go attack. Uh, yeah, we'll go attack, attack, attack. We'll see what happens. I have he plenty of healing items at the moment. Oh, sweet, reading enemy info. Okay. Oh, that's where we go to uh, the beginning part. We're going up here. Come here, you little thing that's clearly the clan that we fought in like the very first dungeon. Thank goodness for uh, Nero's strength there. There's no longer anything to worry about. Let's continue onward. Dead end? I guess so. There's definitely going to be uh, some... Little uh, hidden walls somewhere around here. I've probably missed like six of them. Like you. Nope, nope, okay. Attack, attack, attack. Win it out, just attack a lot. So, shout out to this being also Pizza Saturday. Uh, I'm trying to think of what kind of pizza I want while I'm recording. Master level 7. Get some skill points. Uh, um, also, for the next uh, dungeon, if someone doesn't mind, what level should I get to? Um, I feel like 10 was probably a pretty comfortable level. It's probably actually a little over compared, but that's neither here nor there. Nothing? Can't go this way either. Oh, what are you? Come here, gator. It's a gator. If you saw these things in real life, it would be one of the creepiest things ever. Fish bot. I don't believe you being a fish bot. Um, attack our guard, attack our guard. Wow, got lucky on that one. Also, we're not, like, uh, destroying it in, like, three hits anymore. Wow, that was some experience. Too bad there's no, like, group encounters. Although, group encounters would probably be... Nah, we'd be fine if there was group encounters. Ooh, you have attack for three, Mr. Paradox. When in doubt. So these patterns so far still aren't too bad. But yeah. 
Let me know also in the comments. Question of the day. Here's going to be the question of the day. I haven't done this in a while. Question of the day. What is everyone's favorite pizza place? Activate the switch? Sure. We touched the switch and then we got attacked by a square. How dare you square. Um, break guard. Huh. That's an interesting... Okay, that one was a little challenging. Although, I don't know what the last three were, but... Only downside of killing things in three hits. You never figure out what the full enemy pattern is. You sense danger. It's called Fishbot, and we're gonna kill it. This will be what our grinding shall be. Fish breaks. Fish bots, not fish breaks. Um, I'm... I was about to say, this thing seems like it's uh, pretty easy to read so far. Get out of here, fish bot. Nero, you're always able to win. Win my heart. Also, I think this recording session might actually go long, because we still have this entire dungeon to explore. So I might break this up into another two weeks, so there might be like three weeks of pre-recording. Huh. Um. Guard, guard, attack. Guard, guard, attack. Oh. Well, that's new. Alright. Reading enemy info. Good, because that did a lot of damage. Note to self, fish bots hurt. And I don't know how big the first floor is here, but... Uh, we have a return crystal. We're not going to use those, though. So, in other words, don't mess with the fish bots. Why is there a thing called, like, alligator head bot? That would be cool, right? Alright, well, we're not going to make the same mistake again. Um, because, uh... Oh, well... Man, these things do a lot of damage. Good experience, though. Hmm. I guess we'll go left for now. Yeah, we got a little item here. Make sure. I need to be running into walls more. Although I don't see anything in the distance. Durable gym clothes. Oh. Well, I guess we can sell one of those. I don't remember. Oh, can we go this way now? Ooh, what are you? Man, this first floor is huge. Really? Nothing? 
Guess there's not anything there. Okay, Swindle. Let's see what you've got. Looks like you're breaking a lot. So this ain't guards and attacks. So, good to know on the swindle. Good thing we've got a lot of these, uh, right here.